How to fix 0xc00002e2 BSOD error in Windows Server This error message means that your Windows Server is having trouble accessing, reading, or trusting the Active Directory database, ntds.div. This can happen due to various reasons, such as a power outage, a hardware failure, a malware infection, a corrupted database, or a misconfigured security setting. To fix this error, you can try the following methods, reboot into directory services restore mode, DSRM. DSRM is a special boot mode that allows you to perform maintenance and recovery tasks on your active directory database. To reboot into DSRM, you need to press F8 before the OS begins loading and select directory services restore mode from the menu. You will be required to use the local administrator account password to log in. Once in DSRM, you can use tools like ntsudil.exe or promo.exe to repair or remove your active directory database. Restore from a backup. If you have a recent backup of your Active Directory database, you can use it to restore your server to a working state. To restore from a backup, you need to reboot into DSRM and use the openmin.exe tool or the Windows Server Backup Snap in to restore your system state data. You may also need to perform an authoritative restore if you have multiple domain controllers in your domain. Seize the roles and reinstall the domain controller. If you have another working domain controller in your domain, you can seize the roles from the failed domain controller and reinstall it. To seize the roles, you need to use the ntsudil.exe tool or the Active Directory users and computer snap in on the working domain controller. Then, you need to remove the failed domain controller from the domain using the promo.exe tool or the server manager snap in. After that, you can reinstall the OS and add the Active Directory domain services role back to the server. Other tips 1. In Windows Server 2008 R2 or Windows Server 2008, log in your own directory services repair mode, DSRM, account and run the following commands dism.exe slash online slash get features dism.exe slash online slash enable features slash feature name director services domain controller promo.exe slash force removal to in windows server 2012 and later run these commands instead dism.exe slash online slash get features dism.exe slash online slash enable features slash feature name director services domain controller uninstall ads domain controller force removal these are some of the possible solutions for fixing 0xc00002e2bsod error in windows server